solve by gauss elimination method let us see the working rule first this is the system of equations that has been given first write the equation in matrix form that is ax is equal to b then go for augmented matrix where c is equal to a is to b now this c has to be transformed to this format by elementary row transformation such that you have zeros in these places and you may have any values in other places now this system of equations is solved and the value of x y z are traced now let us write this equation to find the solution in matrix form in matrix form ax is equal to b so now it is 1 4 9 2 1 1 3 2 3 now my x is x y is z and b is 16 10 18 now i have to write this matrix in augmented form so now my augmented matrix is c is equal to a is to b this is equal to 1 4 9 is to 16 2 1 1 is to 10 3 2 3 is to 18 now this matrix has to be simplified to this format with zeros in these places first we have to make these two places zero so that first two transformations which i go for is r2 is r2 minus 2 r1 and r3 is r3 minus 3 r1 so now my matrix will become 1 4 9 and it is 16 0 by simplification we'll get minus 7 minus 17 is minus 22 Again, my R three will also change. It is zero minus ten minus twenty four, and here it is minus thirty. Now, the next step is I have to get zero over here. So, in order to get zero over here, my R three I am replacing it as R three is seven R three minus ten R two. So, this is equal to one four nine sixteen. first row remains as such then second row 0 minus 7 minus 17 minus 22 second row remains as such and third row is 0 0 2 100 is 10 now we have obtained this format of matrix and now this has to be solved for x y n z so i'll get the equations as solve the equations So I'll get the equations as x plus 4y plus 9z is equal to 16. Then next one is minus 7y minus 17. 17z is equal to minus 22. Then 2z is equal to 10. So when I say 2z is equal to 10, I'll be getting z is equal to 5. So now we have obtained z is equal to five. Now we have to substitute z is equal to five in minus seven y minus seventeen z is equal to minus twenty two. Now minus seven y minus seventeen into five is equal to minus twenty. So minus seven y is equal to minus twenty two plus eighty five. So y is equal to sixty three plus sixty three by minus seven. So this is equal to minus nine. So my y is minus nine. So z is equal to five. Y is equal to minus nine. Substitute in x plus four y. Plus nine z is equal to sixteen. So we'll be getting x plus four into minus nine plus nine into five is equal to sixteen. So x minus thirty six plus forty five is equal to sixteen. 
so x is equal to 7 therefore the values are x is equal to 7 y is equal to minus 9 z is equal to 5